support each other yeah. po. Kasi marami kaming mga pangarap and syempre, since sobrang we care about each other and we want we want to see each other like really strive for the best. So yeah, yeah. you ba? I agree. In infinity sign. Well, whenever I see that, I, I, I just think of Andy right away. Actually, got, I got her for her birthday, um, I know, infinity earrings wow. in Pandora. Wow! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. 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 <laughs> for Andy, but yeah, like Andy said, especially being, uh, especially because we're new in the industry, that support system we have, we really hold on to it. Um, we always push each other, kinds of uh, solo projects, um, when we're working together. The support is something that we really hold on tight to. Um, okay, so my literal, but also pa personal natin, oh, no? So it's literal right. would be the banana symbol. Kasi yun yung ginawa ng fans namin. They combined my last name, Banawis, at Malibunas, tapos naging Bananas. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so, personally, diba? Well, magkasunod po kami sa music, oh, oh. sa style. Style. Yeah. Tapos may sabi, usapan po namin country. Oh. Diba, New York po siya. Okay, New York, tapos ako galing France. So, isang pinag-uusapan po namin kung ano ba yung itsura doon sa New York, ano ba yung itsura sa France, oh, okay. diba? Ang oh, oh. kwento natin sa... Tapos minsan, like, mga songs, so connect through that, na parang, ay, Gaby, I told oh. you when I heard this song, gano'n. Oo, oh, tapos sobrang, <laughs> tapos sobrang animated po talaga niya pag gano'n yung... <laughs> Lagi ko nasisimamot sa kanya. Nagagano'n, so, the best, the best. Oh. Pero ra, kasi diba yung pagkala ito sa France, tapos isa na lumangit country, kung may isang lugar sa France na kung saan gusto mo dahil si Gaby, saan ito at ba? Sa Eiffel Tower, nalalayo ko ba tayo? For me, naman, it would have to be Dumbo, a place in Brooklyn. Because it's hard to see aesthetic pictures. Ganun. So, there are a lot of pictures for sure. Dun. And really great food. It's a lot of fun. Do you still have connection with them? Um, honestly, because the you know, close to si Philip, if you remember, Philip, the one from Australia, he's back to Australia now with his kid. That was si John, the man, dito pa siya, yung Japanese guy. We still hang out once in a while, but don't na siya, ano siya masyad ng sa showbiz. And that's why, I guess, to a certain extent, we still connect, but just not as much as before. I mean, I would love to go to Australia to meet Philip again. He's one of my closest buddies. Actually, until now, we still talk once in a while. But it is what it is, you know? That's how life is. Thank you. Thank you, Thank you so much, Mom. And the last one, that's Jim Biancon. That's number. Hello, guys. Good afternoon. Our first question go for the TV connect housemates no kasi very parang ang intense nung time kasi pumasok kayo sa showbiz so parang nagdouble whammy na covid and then shutdown so parang how do you feel na yun nga ang bigat nung season na pinasukan niyo and at the same time you are here being launched in the first star magic movie okay sino first um <laughs> um for me po uh Para sa amin, grateful pa din po ako kahit ayun nga nag-shutdown po and nagkaroon nga ng pandemic. Pero sobrang napilit po ako sa PBB, sa ABS, syempre kila Derek Lawrence, sa pumubuo ng Pinoy Big Brother na nagawan pa rin po nila ng paraan na makabuo ng pandemic season. And feeling ko, so ano po ako, nagpapasalamat po ako kasi kahit alam kong shutdown, magaling po sila, marami po silang platform. And sobrang digital na tayo, napakagaling nila. Kaya nagawa nila ng paraan 
para may palabas din ang Pinoy Big Brother sa A to Z. Siyempre, meron din tayong block tan yata sa TV5, no? sa TV5 po yata. No? So, ayun po, parang magaling po talaga yung ABS, kaya the best. Gail. For me, I have to say siguro, yes, it was difficult for us, pero I think God's timing lang talaga. Yes, the pandemic was a horrible time for all of us, pero feel ko rin naman, if it wasn't for the pandemic, we wouldn't be here today. So, yun nga, everything happens for a reason. Kobe. Ayaw ko po na masabi. Ayaw ko po, sorry. Sana daw. Oh, Andy, ikaw muna. From your season pa lang, it was a very intense and challenging time for the network already. Pero yun, they're still able to give you this beautiful project na kayo pa ang launch. Again po, so grateful ako na, you know, they gave us this project. They they really trusted us to work hard. Um, but it wouldn't have been possible without all the, the staff who helped us. Uh, she directed. I just want to say to you, direct. And I know you know this, but you really boosted my confidence as a person, especially some of my guest things. For whenever I'm doing acting, I love you 40 days. Mas confident ako because you. I remember you told me before. I remember you told me before, direct. Na medyo shaky ako. Um, I couldn't really look into the camera and everything, but you really helped me both, that I guess. Um, see, Derek Ryan did uh, It was a long journey, but we got through it together, and I'm so, I'm just very happy to be part of this project, that we are the ones that they picked uh, for this first movie under Star Magic Studio. For Andy, kasi ikaw naman, kumbaga, hindi mo to launching, di ba? Like, you, had, you have done other films na rin before this. Oh, Opo. Oh. Well, nung nag-start po kasi yung batch namin, grabe, fresh na fresh yung pandemic noon. And, when you think about it, naituwi din na yung successful show for it. And, like, napakilala ng ABS-CBN kami and yung mga batch leads namin. And now na, I have to say that even if I, I had projects from before, napakalaking entrepreneur na I got to be part of this project. It's one. It's I have to consider this as one of my biggest projects as a lead role, and I really got to push myself even more in my acting, in my connections with the cast, with the rest and I I am so grateful. I'm extremely grateful na grabbing tiwala sa amin, ng management, the fact that this is the first movie of Star Magic Studios. 
that idea would really inspire us and motivate us, me especially, to work harder para iprove ko sa kanila na hindi ko sila nagkakamali na pinagkakatiwalaan ko nila. Thank you. For Chimanda. Ko, sino mga na sa'yo? For me, yes po, unfortunate yung pandemic and yung and you uh, shut down. But then I think it also has its perks, especially more people were able to watch from digital platforms. And before it being connected, nagawa ko mga MNK, like for a support. So I'm really thankful and blessed na I was able to do this project and it really taught me discipline because the amount of focus na kailangan ko dito hindi ko siya biro. And um, yeah, because filming this was kind of hard for me, and I had like everyday breakdowns. <laughs> yeah, I had everyday breakdowns, <laughs> but then not anymore. Happy now, say I really enjoy what's happening now. I enjoy photo shoots and stuff, and that's why I was saying kanina na I enjoy seeing the fruits of the hard work. Sorry, follow up lang dun sa may mention mo. How were you able to overcome? Through my friends, of course. And yung staff, grabe. Pero ginag-joke, like, ginag-joke nila ako, like, sasabihin ko yung card kung tumakas ka dito. Guys, <laughs> <laughs> like, Christmas break, no? So gusto ko yung mabas-labas. Bawat. So, ayun. But, I was able to overcome it. And, yeah. Funny na lang pag inisip ko lang. Last year. Uh, I think uh, ganun sa natin ni Ralph at ni Gail, uh, yung sobrang hilang talaga. Uh, yung pumasok ka ng pandemia and grabe. Pero I think sa, yung nakita ko yung ending, I think sa calling na sa Big Four. Kasi nagsumayaw kami ni Gail at sumayaw kami ni Ralph and ni Amanda. Para iba. You know, the ABS is amazing. They always make it work. Nasa labas na kami sa bahay mo, doon lang yung broad, and then launching sa still up until now, kahit uh, yung, nakita ko yung iba na in our, when, when we do workshops, iba yung workshops nila in person sa aming Zoom, parang I'm still grateful. I'm still grateful na parang doing this and with the talented director and with the talented people. It's amazing. and yung ginawa na namin yung of course uh, the movie everything it was the best uh, especially doing workshops uh, and director was really hands on talaga sa akin so yeah uh, it was really amazing amazing experience and uh, we really enjoyed it thank you last question na lang directed kasi parang lahat ng na-handle mo na sa'yo nag-uumpisa, di ba, yung mga love teams. And parang coincidentally, sila din ay nagkakatuluyan or nagkakatotohanan. So, with that experience, ano ang advice na binigay mo sa ating six love teams? And pangalawa, may nakikita ka ba sa kanila na parang magkakatotohanan ala Liz, Ken, Josh, Leah, and Lauren? <laughs> Ako ba talagang lalaglag? Hindi, ah! <laughs> um, yeah, may ako Pero hindi ko pa rin sabihin kung sino. Hilaan na lang ng mga fans. May parang ano, nagkakalapit na sis. <laughs> Kaya yung marites. But yeah, if, kung ako yung pwedeng... Gusto, actually, yung gusto ko pala yung ina-advise is... Kasi like for... Like, hindi ko naman alam na magiging Josh Lee. Obviously, hindi na din that movie. But, but siguro yung advice ko is... Um... Ako wag. <laughs> wag. Kasi yung... Ang pinaka longest love in the Philippine industry, I think, na kaya nga ngayon, pwede person buwawa is, di ba, kawarin ng ABS, si Changloy at si Bella, never na yun sila eh. So, parang nakakatulong na um, professional lang. Kasi, pag, mahirap kasi pag kayo tapos pinang mag-aaway, dissolve yung love. And this, of course, forever pa rin kayo, like, at nilo, ayan, sila pa rin. So, baka naman may mga kanong success stories. Nag-iahe naman si Rad. So, <laughs> so, so, yeah. So, baka mali ako. Baka mali ako. Pero naman palang katil at please care na hanggang ngayon sila ang maganda. But if ikaw na ang mag-aan pa? Mahirap po. Siguro na yung mahirap sa akin as a director kasi I've worked with other sa mga teleserye na mga mag-jowa tapos pag nagka-away. Ang hirap sa serye. 